Black holes are one of the universe's most mysterious and disturbing forces. However, the scariest thing about black holes is probably that nobody quite knows what they are. There are theories ranging from the mundane to the cosmic, but no one knew for sure. One recent discovery might have finally found out what they really are, so let's explore. Before we dive into the newest findings, it's important to rehash everything scientists have discovered so far about black holes, which admittedly isn't that much. What we do know is what we examine from the outside of the black holes and the movement of objects that get too close. For example, we know black holes have an intense gravitational pull, which makes it impossible for anything to escape once they are pulled in. We also know that black holes emit radiation, which is known as Hawking radiation, named after the famous physicist Stephen Hawking. The issue, however, is that we don't know much more than that. There are several problems with black holes that make it almost impossible to discover more information about them. There are two major issues. The first is that the gravity is so strong that light is unable to escape. Because light is unable to escape, we can't see the black hole or gather any information from it. You can imagine it as similar to being in a dark room. There's no way to figure out what's inside or even see the items in there. The second issue is that the temperature of these massive objects is so cold that it's virtually impossible to detect any information. For black holes roughly the size of the sun, the radiation emitted from them is so weak and cool that the temperature is only one millionth of a degree above absolute zero. Beyond that though, some black holes are thought to weigh a billion times as much as the sun and would be a billion times colder far below what scientists have achieved on Earth. All this presents massive problems for scientists. How could we ever figure out what's really going on inside a black hole? Beyond this, how did we even manage to discover these massive space objects that seem to bend the laws of physics? The idea of a black hole exclusively was first proposed in the 1700s by astronomer John Michel. He wrote a paper in 1784 that described an invisible object with a mass so large that not even light could escape its gravity. His very ancient calculations assumed that this object would only be possible if it had a density as large as that of the sun, and he suggested that it could be detected through its gravitational effect on nearby objects. Although the information he published was largely inaccurate, he did make several important discoveries that still remain relevant today. For instance, he proposed that black holes might be detectable through their gravitational effects, something that has been confirmed many times since. But his discovery wasn't to shock the scientific world for quite a while. It remained forgotten. Fast forward to more recent scientific developments, and far more recently in 2019, long after his theory was published and widely accepted, scientists made a massive discovery that changed the game when it comes to black holes. This discovery, of course, was the first ever image of a black hole. Using a series of radio telescopes around the world, scientists were able to confirm and document the elusive black hole. With a simple caption that read, this is the first picture of a black hole scientists finally had visual confirmation of what they had only theorized. Now it's important to recognize that the search for the black hole is far from over. While scientists have made the monumental discovery of the first ever image of a black hole, far more questions have been raised than answered. At least that is until recently. The most recent discovery scientists have made seems to have completely blown away every previous discovery out of the water, and might even reveal what black holes really are, but there have been plenty of theories leading up to this point. So let's explore a few. The first and most popular theory is that black holes are regions of space-time where gravity is so strong that not even light can escape. This means that no matter or energy is able to escape the intense gravity, effectively making it a bottomless pit. This is the theory that most scientists believe in and has been the status quo for quite a while now. 
However, more recently, scientists have come up with an interesting but complex theory that suggests that black holes are actually doorways to other universes. This is commonly known as the interstellar theory because it directly links with the movie of the same name. In this theory, it suggested that when objects cross a black hole's event horizon, they actually end up in an entirely different universe or even a completely different timeline. Pretty shocking, and probably the coolest theory about black holes out there. Now, let's take a look at scientists' most recent discovery, something that could very well shock the world and blow everything we previously thought we knew out of the water. This is called the theory of holographic duality, and it suggests that black holes are actually two-dimensional objects, or more accurately, that black holes can exist in two dimensions and three dimensions at the same time. Juan Maldacena discovered this concept in 1997, and it states that events inside a space with gravity, like a black hole, are mathematically equivalent to gravity-free events on the surface of that space that involve particles. Sound too sciency? In simple terms, this means that the events that happen on the inside of a black hole have an exact mathematical correlation with events on the outer surface. But wasn't the discovery in 1997? That can hardly be called new. Not so fast. In recent months, there has been a massive breakthrough in this theory. Professor Anatoly Dymarsky and his team of researchers have proposed that holographic duality explains the emergence of thermal ensembles in quantum systems, which is crucial for understanding how black holes work. What this means is that black holes can be thought of as two-dimensional objects, meaning that events on the inside of a black hole can be studied in order to find out more information about them. This means that scientists can finally start to understand and describe the properties of black holes, which could be a major step forward in our search for answers. We may never be able to study the inside of a black hole. These objects defy every possible law of physics and can't be seen or studied in the traditional way. But this new discovery could finally give us some insight into what these mysterious events are really made of. It could also potentially give us a way to study these objects in a new and exciting way, giving us the chance to finally understand what these objects are and how they work. There you have it. This new incredible discovery could potentially answer the age-old question of what black holes really are. While we are still a long way off from finding out the true nature of these mysterious objects, this new discovery could be a major step in that direction. But what are your thoughts? Go ahead and drop a comment, and we'll see you in the next video.